Welcome everyone. Welcome to day four COVID update. I do want to just let you know I appreciate all of your comments and all your prayers. It's been really uh, very helpful and supportive. In fact, my wife went out and got me these while she ordered them online. Oh, they are safety glasses. So a step towards safety, another step towards safety. So uh, last Wednesday, uh, today is Sunday. So last Wednesday, I've started noticing a, I had a sore throat, cough, uh, feeling tired. I took a COVID, one of those at-home COVID tests, and it came out negative. I thought, okay, I just, uh, just maybe it's getting, maybe I'm getting old, 69 years old. Who knows? So anyway, um, went to work the next day, and I worked till noon or so, and I was just wiped right out. And while the guys were working, I sat in my truck, just couldn't do anything. And I just went home and took a test on Thursday, and it was positive. And I had this cough, um, super tired, uh, a little bit achy, had not lost sense of smell or taste, no headaches, um, just achy. Uh, so... I, I decided not to work. I let those guys work uh, Friday. I took Friday and Saturday off, did nothing. Dro drove me crazy just sitting around. But then uh, started Saturday, started feeling much better. The cough had gone away mostly. Um, it was still a little sore throat, but today, uh, it's Sunday afternoon, no, no effects really. Um, I don't have a sore throat, no cough. I'm, I'm not achy. I am still a little bit tired, so I'm, I'm going to quarantine for um, whatever the prescribed amount is. I think it's five days after you tested positive. So that would be somewhere around Tuesday, tomorrow, maybe Monday, Monday or Tuesday. Uh, I should be clear to go, and I, I feel much better. I, it's I'm so thankful that it just went went uh, quickly, and, I, and it didn't linger. So uh, that's that part. So talking, let's talk about uh, the economy a little bit. And yes, it's it's <laughs> lately has just never been good. Uh, I got a letter from the concrete company. They had sent me a letter in uh, February showing what their prices would be for the year. And I think for 35 years since I've been doing this, they would send a letter every year, every year in February or so saying we're going up this much. They would typically it'd be like a typical cost of living increase. Uh, it might be a dollar or two per yard. And so that's what they did. But we got a letter Friday, two days ago, that they're going up seven dollars per yard per cubic yard of concrete uh if it's effective in a couple of weeks i think um fortunately we have most of our concrete in place uh or we will have by the time their price increase goes into effect we will have one more to do in august uh, that's going to it means an increase of about eighty dollars for the total project so it's not not nice but it's not overwhelming uh, we've purchased again we've purchased all the other materials ahead of time so we know that we've locked in our costs uh, except I, did, I didn't see concrete cost increasing i didn't see that coming so it took me by surprise a little bit but that's what it is uh, i have my drone out here I thought it might be fun to take it up and just take a look at the the greenery. It's pretty cool. It's uh, the leaves are starting to come out. So let's fire this baby up. The drone's working really great right now. So I'm going to uh, turn on the video 
and we'll just take a look around and see what we got. I have it on cine, cinematic mode. It's really beautiful, the colors now. FAA has required that we go do not exceed 400 feet and so the the drone gets locked in at at a when it hits 400 it'll tell me you'll hear a little beep 400 feet I'm at 105 meters maximum flight altitude reached so that's that's my height And I put it on automatic home. Go home. Go home. All right. Looks like a pretty good chance of rain in a little bit, so I'm going inside. Uh, I'm hoping towards the middle of the week I'll actually be back to working uh, on a limited basis, taking it easy. And uh, again, I really appreciate your support. If you want to leave a comment, go ahead. And if you're not a, a subscriber, I'd appreciate it if you would subscribe and uh, hit the like button. Thanks again, and uh, we'll have more videos coming out.